Family seems to be for me as the main, the main topic of my life. When I started Ami like 12 years ago, it was really a family affair. Salut. Ça va? The first customers are my friends, the first customers are my family. Tout va bien? Arsène, Alexandre, enchanté. Alexandre, enchanté. Ami, because Ami means friend, you know, in French. So here we are. It's really about us first. It's like my babies, huh? Again. So, I love them very much. And then, as we say in French, uh, les amis de mes amis sont mes amis. Uh, it became like a community around the world that, that is big now. This is a beautiful object, you know? We were talking about how we would love to make a new project. C'est magnifique, hein? Salut. Bonjour. Tu vas bien? Ça va et toi? Super. The idea was we all come from different families, different ways to understand that concept, if we can talk about this as a concept, and how that can be interpreted into a picture. And we felt um, that it was a very good subject to work on. When we asked them to work on this theme about family, they were it's so intimate, you know? People have shared so personal, you know, memories and, and beliefs and thoughts that makes, you know, this very special. It's not just a book of pictures, it's uh, people's stories. Usually before I start working on a project, I try to read a lot about the topic and then brainstorm about like visual ideas, trying to do a mood board. Before Ami, I, for example, I kind of wrote like a to-do list of what kind of motives I want to photograph, which kind of moments I want to have for the short story. And then kind of in the end, of course, every picture turns completely different than I imagined, but it's like kind of the beginning of of my working process. So it's a collection where in the end it became an edit of six pictures. Of course it was much more. And it's like this kind of short story uh, um, of this clown, this lonely clown who doesn't have enough to eat, who is lonely, who is dreaming of some somebody to be with, who he understands with, to have a family in this modern world where no one is really interested in any magical happening anymore. I think every one of the artists looks like completely different at the world, so you see it also with the topic family, how and how many different sides you can go to to show what is family. These photographers, most of them, you know, reporters, journalists, they are covering, you know, uh, actuality, big subjects all around the world and trying to bring them back to an intimacy from their own perspective as what family means to them was, I think, a very interesting project to work on for them. The piece is called Apartment 2022 and for me, I really wanted to kind of show or capture different kinds of families and I think the best way to kind of visually show that is to kind of show the parallel lives that exist within the same plane. I was thinking a lot about how a place can kind of represent family. I kind of came up with this idea of an apartment building because of this multi-story building that I grew up in, which I think most South Koreans live in. Seeing so many different families like stacked on top of each other, but then kind of not knowing the details of like what is going on behind the doors showed me that within the sameness that we show on the 
outside, there is very different forms and relationships that exist within. I've been working with this concept for all my life and it's something that is related with my experience in life but as well my experience in my community and also in my country. The idea was to talk more about the concept of family but what it means in terms of territory, genealogy and in terms of the sense of uh, what family means in the universe. I really love this one. For me, like this, a sense of the water, but it feels like a dreamy a scene, you know. So I really love this one because it's related with all the, the, the concept that I was trying to, to achieve. It doesn't matter that we have the same blood. We are connected to, to the universe and we are you know, living something in, in space and time together. You know, all the people we meet all around the world have something to say and we give them the opportunity to say something in a very intimate way. It's an international project. Azami is an international brand. I love this very much. I love this project very much. It's not just about having this in Paris, it's trying to make this exhibition travel because I think it, it concerns everyone. It's like a beautiful exhibition. Family, Miami, Miam uh, Miam. I'm joking. I first had a meeting with Jonathan Ferrari, who is the art director of the brand. It was like love on the first side. It was like magic what happened between us. They hired us to do something and they didn't, they didn't say, no, this is not good, this is not good, this is not good. They said, you are the artist, you have to do whatever you think is good for the project and let's do it, let's do it together. They understood this artistic freedom. So it was really one of my best collaborations ever. It was really a conversation and the best conversations are still in process. This is just the beginning of something, I feel.